It's just... Have you lost a bunch of weight and now there's this big mass of excess skin surrounding your stomach? You're thin, but you still look skinny fat. Or you don't want to lose those last extra pounds because you're afraid of getting the loose skin. Oh, it looks like a tongue. Before you get depressed or try to fill up that skin with some extra fat again, then you need to watch this video. I'm gonna give you some ways of tightening up that loose skin after weight loss. I'm thin! Number one, get more collagen. Collagen is an amino acid that's used for the skin, hair, nails, tendons and other vital organs. For the skin in particular, collagen can make your skin more elastic and supple. The body produces collagen, but this decreases with age and poor diet. It's important to get adequate amounts of protein and all the other amino acids like elastin, glycine, proline and many others. Foods particularly high in this anti-aging collagen are tendon meats like beef colored, ligaments, chicken thighs, wings, ribs and bone broth soup. Other foods rich in collagen are fish like salmon and sardines, especially the bones, eggs and oysters. Plant-based foods should be higher in sulfur, which is needed for producing collagen. These foods include green leafy vegetables, garlic and onions. Gotu Kola is another Ayurvedic herb that promotes collagen and it fights against cellulite. Gelatin supplementation has also been shown to improve skin elasticity. Naturally, gelatin can be found in foods like oxtail, chicken feet or ribs. Jello is also a source of gelatin, but you want to make sure it's sugar free. Combining gelatin with borage oil can have even greater skin elasticity effects. There's always room for jello. <laughs> Number two, stop smoking. Smoking and other carcinogens lower your skin's elasticity and decrease collagen levels as well. One study on 64 female Italian smokers showed that the average biological age of the participants was nine years older than their actual chronological age. What's more, after nine months of not smoking, the biological age of the women's skin was reduced by 13 years. Basically, smoking not only accelerates your overall aging, but it also makes your skin age faster as well. P.S. Drinking alcohol isn't any good for your skin either. Number three, get enough vitamins. Vitamin C is used for building collagen and gelatin by supporting tissue growth and repair. Foods high in vitamin C are vegetables, fermented foods, fruit, berries and peppers. Vitamin E is important for skin health thanks to its antioxidant and UV protective qualities. Foods high in vitamin E are almonds, spinach, avocados, sweet potatoes and sunflower seeds. Vitamin A supports healthy skin cell production. It also stimulates fibroblasts which keep the skin more firm and tight. Foods highest in vitamin A are organ meats like liver, squash, sweet potatoes and kale. Biotin or vitamin B7 maintains youthful skin, hair and nails. Biotin in large amounts can be found in organ meats, eggs, avocados, fish, mushrooms and cruciferous. Omega-3 supplementation has many health benefits for the brain, heart and skin. You should eat wild caught oily fish, take fish oil or krill oil, but you can also consume algae products. Chlorella and spirulina have additional detoxification benefits that can boost stem cell growth and autophagy. Vitamin D is one of the most important nutrients for the human body. It influences your mood, metabolism, weight loss, cardiovascular health and brain function. Getting natural sunlight every day, especially in the morning, is crucial for overall health and well-being. You shouldn't take high amounts of antioxidant supplements because they decrease your body's natural ability to adapt to oxidative stress and can actually promote disease. You want to eat natural foods where the amounts of micronutrients and vitamins are in the more balanced quantities. It's only vitamins. Number four, build muscle. Fat tissue is stored in between muscle and skin. If you lose the fat, then you'll end up with a lot of empty space that characterizes this flabby look. To help tighten up the skin and make yourself look more full, you need to build some muscle. I'm not talking about becoming a big bodybuilder. Or even a fat powerlifter. What you want to do is build lean muscle mass to fill up that empty space. More muscle makes you look more fuller, creates a more attractive physique, promotes burning of more fat and gives you a more dense appearance. 
The skinny fat look not only looks bad, but it's also a sign of poor metabolic health and too much muscle catabolism. Muscle is also a vital organ for longevity as your metabolic rate, your hormones, your bone structure and tendons are all dependent on your muscle mass. The key is to do heavy resistance training that actually builds muscle hypertrophy. If you're doing too much low intensity cardio or if you're using too many high repetitions, then you may end up actually losing muscle mass. That's why people who aren't exercising at high enough intensities tend to get that saggy skinny fat look. They're simply burning through the glycogen stores and they convert their own muscle into energy instead. If you want to fill out your loose skin after a diet, then you have to focus on building muscle and strength. During this time, you don't want to be putting too much emphasis on cardio because, yeah, you're gonna basically burn through your muscle. The pump. Number 5. Red Light Therapy. Research has shown that specific wavelengths between the 600 to 900 nanometers have a very positive effect on the body. This red and near infrared light, it can pass through the skin and it has many beneficial effects on collagen synthesis and ATP production. Red light builds more mitochondria, reduces oxidative stress and heals the skin. You can do red light therapy by taking infrared saunas, going to functional health facilities or getting yourself a red light therapy device at home. If you want to get your own red light device from the brand I'm using, then you can use my affiliate link to get a 10% discount. Simply Red, standing by. Number 6. Some additional skincare tips. Coconut oil has antibacterial and moisturizing properties that soften the skin. Rubbing coconut oil over your entire belly or thighs can be too extensive. What you can do is simply use a little bit of coconut oil in certain more stubborn regions where the skin is most loose. Avoid skincare products and soaps that contain sulfate and chloride. These and many other compounds dry the skin and reduce elasticity. Our bodies already get exposed to too many environmental toxins through food, water, air and plastics. So you don't want to add another stressor. Consuming activated charcoal and algae supplements can also help with the detox. Epsom salt baths can help to moisturize your skin and replenish your body with magnesium which is an essential mineral for nerve and muscle functioning. Sea salt scrubs are said to help with blood circulation, which can tighten up the skin. Feel how soft my skin is. But we should also talk about how to prevent getting the loose skin after dieting. To not get loose skin, you have to make sure that you're losing fat, not muscle. Here are a few ways of not ending up like looking like an empty sack of potatoes at the end of your diet. Avoid long periods of caloric restriction. It's true that in order to lose weight, you need to be eating fewer calories, but prolonged periods of crash dieting, they can slow down your metabolism, wreck your hormones and make you lose a lot of muscle. Extended fasting is a much faster and healthier way of losing weight than restrictive dieting. If you're in a fasted state, you'll switch into ketosis, which makes you preserve muscle tissue and makes you burn your body fat exclusively. With a 5-day fast of consuming no calories, you're actually burning more fat than with a restrictive diet that lasts for 2-3 to three weeks. The difference is that you're gonna maintain your muscle mass more and you're gonna preserve your hormones as well. You wanna avoid gluconeogenesis of your muscle tissue as well. Gluconeogenesis occurs if you fast outside of a ketogenic state or when you burn through your muscle glycogen stores during intense exercise without refilling them. That's why it's much more effective to lose fat with intermittent fasting and the ketogenic diet. Your body's glucose demands decrease and you preserve more muscle while losing primarily your body fat. Artificial sweeteners and BCA drinks can also make you lose muscle at a caloric deficit. If you're consuming something that has this sweetness to it, then you're indicating your body that it's time to burn glucose. However, because BCAs have little to zero calories, then the body will start searching for glucose by burning your own muscle tissue. There is no reason to be consuming BCAs when you're fasting or when you're doing keto because you're already so protein sparing and you don't need that much glucose. Branch chain amino acids would be effective only if you worked out very intensely for longer periods of time in a fasted state. So the best fat for making soap comes from humans. But fasting is also great for tightening up that loose skin. Around 48 to 72 hours of fasting, fasting triggers a process called autophagy, which recycles old cellular material into energy. This has many anti-inflammatory effects, increases longevity, supports detox, and can help to lose that loose skin. Autophagy literally translates into self-digestion and it will eat up cancerous cells, toxins, tumor growth factors, weak mitochondria and dead skin. Moment please. <laughs>
all of these practices that I mentioned, they should be a part of a holistic health lifestyle. You want to fast. You want to eat nutritious foods, you want to exercise, you want to build muscle, you want to avoid the toxins, and you want to de-stress yourself overall on a daily basis. Before taking the desperate maneuver of going for a surgery, you need to think about whether or not it's actually loose skin, or maybe it's simply excess fat. Maybe you still have a ton of fat to lose. But other than that, thanks for watching this video, make sure you click the like, subscribe, notification bell as well. My name is Seem, stay tight, stay empowered.